Yes, we're coming back strong, ladies and gents. Autumn, winter, fall trends 2023. Not only that, but these are going to be wearable, classic. They will take you through your lifetime. So stick around. I know I've been away. We'll talk about that too. Hi everybody and welcome back. My God, it is so good to be back. And yes, I'm coming back good and strong and full of energy with Autumn Trends 2023. Before we go along, Angel Chair by Killian. This one has cinnamon. She has praline and sandalwood and vanilla. And she is just, she's got cognac oil in there. She's got, uh, yes, I said tonka bean. She's just delicious. She's perfect for autumn. Coming up to Christmas, I will link her down below. If, you know, for the one you love, she's a bit pricey, but well worth it. And you just need a little spray. The shout out of today is for Geraldine McQuaid. Hi, Geraldine, how are you? Mwah. Now, for those of you wondering where I was, for those of you who don't give a bleep, I will actually do that in another video. Uh, maybe get ready with me if you're interested. If you don't care, we're just going to jump into autumn trends because I don't want to keep you too long. So if you want are interested in a get ready with me video, wanting to know where I've been for the last couple of months, let me do know down below. It's fabulous to be back. I'm going to kick off. I have eight fall trends for you here. I picked out the best of the best. Uh, there are a lot coming in strong, but I just wanted to go with the ones that I feel you will wear in your wardrobe. They will be versatile. They will be value for money. They will be timeless, elegant, sophisticated, and they will take you from season to season to season to season. Build your wardrobe. I'm all about, I had a good think over, you know, the, the break I had away, and I just want to build my perfect capsule wardrobe. Hold on. Yes, we are recording. Thank God. My God, it's like riding a bicycle, except harder. It is hard with all this camera equipment and lights and stuff. Anyway, I digress. So the first trend, but I don't feel it's a trend. I feel it's a piece that everybody should have in their wardrobe, is the Power Blazer. In 2023 and on the runways, it was all about big shoulders. And you know we all had the, um, you know we had the oversized blazer for the last few trends. It's still around. So it's kind of a mixture of different styles and different trends, but you have got to find what suits you. So the power blazer, and there's a very much an office core kind of a look coming in with everybody going back to work. It's a strong, powerful look. So big shoulders. The blazers now are more cinched in at the waist which is very flattering, I might add. And as I said, if you find your right size, the right color, the right structure, fabric and material is so, so important for your item to fit you well. The material is really, really important. I just don't like anything with polyester in it. I'm all about really great materials, whether it be wool, whether it be 100% cotton, even if it's a blend, if it's a linen blend or a wool blend, it's better than anything with polyester in it for all sorts of reasons, environmental, the way it looks, polyester is quite cheap looking. So if you can at all, even in the sales, even if you only invest in one piece per season to your wardrobe, you need less amount but great quality clothes. Now I'm going to bring out my my little oldie but a goodie in my Balmain. People might say, Viv, this is out of fashion. Not to me, it's not. It's a standard classic colour of that beautiful navy blue. Navy being very, very in this season, might I add. Love this shirt, by the way. It's silk. It's gorgeous. It's by Daisy Silk. Beautiful. And so I love this blazer. It is cinched in at the waist. I will be rocking this this year. And I, she's 100% wool. Just can't go wrong with this. If you can get her, I know they're expensive. You can get dupes. You can get them in the sales. You can get them on the second hand market and I just think this is a real investment piece that you can pull out year after year after year and literally rock it. She's going to really really flatter your figure being cinched in and just absolutely beautiful. That's my Balmain piece. Now that we're talking about this uh, blouse that I've on, this is yes by Daisy Silk. This is not sponsored at all. They gifted me this and I just love it. She's 100% mulberry silk, breathable, no allergies whatsoever. They customise your shirts if you like. What I love about this is she has the little uh, detail on the Demanta button down here, a little cinched tie waist, very much for the season, and just an elegant piece that you can wear over a little vest, as I have done here, wear her with wide leg trousers. I'll put in some B-roll here for you to have a look. Just beautiful, have a look. Actually, and they also gifted me a white shirt, which I will show you later because we're going to be talking about white shirts. Now, the next one I want to talk about, leading on there from being structured and buying a piece that is well fit, well, well made, brilliant material, is tailoring. 
Tailoring, my dear girls and boys, is your friend. Whether it be a piece that you get and it doesn't fit you properly and you bring it to your own tailor. That, like I remember watching Friends years ago, Jennifer Aniston, well, how do her t-shirts fit her so well? Because she gets everything tailored. My own mother gets everything tailored. Her pants, her t-shirts, everything. It just makes all the difference. So you will see in the shops and everywhere you're at this year, tailored jackets, tailored pants, which I think I have actually picked up a few pairs of beautiful tailored pants. And if you want to go to places like to find them, go to Cost, go to Arquette, go to Reese. Oh my God, the tailoring is just incredible. Yes, they're a little bit more expensive, but again, they're investment pieces that I want to have in my wardrobe for years. I do not want this fast fashion of running in and running out and picking up things that I'm going to have to replace and the material and fabric aren't great. Now I will have a haul and you're going to need to subscribe and you're going to need to hit the notifications because I'm going to do a whole autumn series. My next couple of videos are going to be like, you know, how to style the pieces, what I have in in my autumn wardrobe, what I think you should buy. But this is just telling you what's in at the moment. So this is the start of this autumn series and I hope you're going to really, really enjoy it. So tailoring is really, really important. Get yourself some tailored pants. Get yourself a tailored jacket. It's just stunning. Instead of your, even though jeans, I'm a real jeans girl, but this year it's all about the pants, whether they be wide leg, whether they be, you know, high waist with pleats in the front and pockets, that kind of masculine look. But again, it's office core, it's strong, it's powerful. It's really, really beautiful. Number three, we have flat shoes. Oh my God. Like I've, I've been a six inch heel girl all my life. And as I've got older, the heels are going down, you know, five, four, three, because not able for it anymore but I am in love with the shoes this season some seasons I find myself I just don't like anything this season is really dangerous for me because I'm loving everything I'm loving the shoes I'm loving the tailoring I'm loving the just everything I'm going to get onto that in a minute but just let me just let me show you a couple now the shoes that I am just loving at the moment are the Mary Janes they're functional you can move in them they're comfortable you can walk in them but they're beautiful and they're stylish. Would you just look at these? Now, I have just looked up so many and saved them in my little albums. I'm creating little uh, vision boards for myself. These ones are from Where's That From? That's where I got these. I think I, yeah, where's that from? And they are, I will link them down below. They weren't expensive. They're suede. And I love the height of the heel on these. I put them on and they're really comfy because they've got a round toe. And I've sprayed them in the... Um, Cadillac spray suede protector but look at that they are just so dinky so beautiful so elegant and as I said with a pair of pants wide pants a little skirt a little dress I am going to be rocking these for the whole of the autumn now suede doesn't go well in the rain but if you do spray them you know I mean and again they weren't that expensive they're just a beautiful shoe I also picked up another I told you I love this look these ones now are kind of look hanging around running around to the shops things like this I got these on I think it was sports direct they're from Slazenger size six and these are a canvas little flat I don't know if the camera's picking them up very well there a little flat shoe. I will maybe put in a little bit of B-roll. It's got this little ankle strap, this little buckle here as well. And these are so comfy. I've already tried them on and been running around the house in them. And I just think they're so dinky. They were like 30, 40 quid. Again, I will link them down below. I have seen stunning ones that I'm going to go back for in Zara. And I know I'm talking about more expensive pieces today. But if you're going to have something like, like you know, these ones, like these shoes are probably going to be in for a season. The pair of ones are, they're a double strap, an ankle strap, I'll put in a picture, and a little cross strap, and a pointy toe. Pointy toe shoes are very much in this season as well, and they were €45. Euro. I'm definitely going back for them, and I'll link them down below. I don't have them right now, but I'll have them by Friday. And uh, I will definitely link them, because they're just stunning. And as I said, very wearable, very comfortable, and very practical. We love that. You know, we need to be able to wear what we buy. Now, in at number four, I just wanted to talk about colour trends for this season. Red is in. Red, vibrant, sexy, passionate red. And I know I told you, ladies, for those of you who are my OGs, for any newcomers, hi, my name is Vivian. I talk about handbags, fashion, lifestyle, and other stuff too. If you're interested, just subscribe down below and come and say hi. Uh, we have a luxury little family here going on and it's brilliant. So all my OGs will know I was thinking about selling this beauty because I didn't wear her 
Well, <laughs> eating my words now, aren't I? Yeah, because this is the colour of the season and this is my vintage beauty with the 24 karat gold plated hardware and I am going to be rocking her this season. For sure, navy and red is just a beautiful combination. Grey and red is another beautiful combination and grey is another, uh, another colour that's very, very much in this season. So we have navy, we have red, which is just... A little pop of red somewhere mixed I think with a grey. Uh, other colours that are in are taupes, browns and it's just that fresh kind of elevated you know, intricato woven leather in yellow and this could be a beautiful pop. Again yellow is beautiful with grey and I just think grey is just, it's so sophisticated, it's so elegant and again it will take you from season to season. Following on from there, we are going to talk about jewellery. Jewellery this year, believe it or not, all of us gold lovers out there, silver is banging this season. So you've got your silver hoops, you've got all your big, big uh, statement earrings, you've got your bold kind of Bottega style silvers, you've got silver on buckles, you've got silver on bags, silver everywhere. So it's nice for people who are silver lovers, obviously, and if you like both, which I actually happen to do, I do love my gold, but I actually have an awful lot of white gold and platinum too. Now is the season to rock all your edgy silver. Um, you've got your ovals, you've got your hoops, and you've got your kind of abstract shapes that are all it very, very much in, uh, in vogue for this season. Now, number seven, we have to talk about leather. Leather is so in this season, we've got leather jackets, we've got leather skirts, we've got leather trousers, we've got faux leather, and it is all over the place. So if you like your punky, rocky, edgy, hardcore statement piece, whether it be a trench, they're very, very much in this season, whether it be your bomber jacket, they are very, very in. And I've seen some beautiful pieces on Vestiaire, and I must link some down below. I might try and find some on Fashion File as well, if you're interested. And if you have that leather piece that you haven't worn in the back of your wardrobe for the last 10 years, pull her out. You can get it tailored, you can get it altered. What I think of leather, and speaking of bomber jackets, the bomber jacket, and I just want to show you, even though I said I was going to show you this in my haul, I have got a few, a good few new pieces, and I picked up this absolute beauty, if you can see. She's like a woolen fabric, and I love this for to bring some texture to an outfit. So if you're wearing like satin pants, or if you're wearing just like, you know, plain kind of pants, and you wanna bring some texture, you've got this bomber jacket, which is very simple. It's got the two pockets here. It's got the zipped pocket on the side. It's got the round neck, and it's got the elasticated waistband, and I could not leave this behind. Now, yes, this is Zara, and yes, I'm talking about get yourself some investment pieces, but you can mix them with some high street if you don't feel like the trend is going to last. Like, I feel like a blazer is a classic piece you'll have in your wardrobe forever and ever and ever. Spend money on. I feel a pair of pants, trousers, wool pants, you, they're going to be in your wardrobe forever. Spend money on. If it's a trendier item, like a bomber jacket, not necessarily going to be, you know, on trend, be on trend this year, not next year, then maybe buy this in the high street. This is the way I work my wardrobe. But also when I saw this, this was an absolutely, yes, I have to buy that right now piece. It's very much me. I jump in and out of the car, consider your lifestyle and how you do your day to day when you're doing your shopping. And that will stand to you. This piece, as I said, grey with navy is just so classic. It it's also going to be beautiful with red. Look at that together. I'm going to be doing way more styling this year, way more outfits and stuff like that as well, because we can all have the handbags, lady, but we need to have the outfits to wear properly with the handbags, right? And excuse my hands, they're full of psoriasis, hence why my nails aren't done. One of the reasons I haven't been on here, I will talk about that in a get ready to meet with me if you fancy. So that is my little grey bomber jacket that I just love. This was 70 euros and I, I will link it down below. Not showing you anything else because you're going to have to hit the notification bell for the next video and I'll show you all the stuff I bought because it's well worth buying. And now is a great time to go in to Zara, to wherever you want to buy your, your clothes. Massimo Duty, Reese, Cost, they have all the best, Arquette, the very, very best pieces. Need to be back, I have to say. 
Um, it's just lovely talking to you guys again and I hope you're enjoying it. I hope you're glad to see me back as well. And you know what, thanks a million for staying around because you might have gone, well that one's not around so I'm not going to stick around for her anymore. So thank you. So last but not least, hold on there now, is the classic white shirt. Now I'm not going to show you the ones, I've bought a couple, I've bought a couple. But I am going to show you the one I was gifted because I just love, I don't know how, I must count how many white shirts I have. I've done an, a wardrobe, kind of a declutter for the autumn season as well so I can see exactly what I have. And uh, Daisy Silk also gifted me this beauty. So she is, again, the mulberry silk. Look at that for material. It's all about the fabrics. So again, this uh, is good for allergies. It's a natural fabric material. And as I said, they can customize certain products for you in Daisy Silk. And the detail on the shirts, I'll put in some B-roll. Look at the little pearls. Like so, so elegant. So, so beautiful. And I just love this. A white shirt. You can't go wrong. You just cannot go wrong. White, cream, off-white pick them up silk cotton actually i think they've given me a discount code they have given me a discount code it's been so long since i made a video forgive me i will put it down below for you it's not a sponsored video they did gift this and i'm just passing on the love so there's your first piece or a navy piece whichever you find this is your classic and this one is more your crossover actually you could wear this one open if you fancy as well i like to wear them open sometimes with a white vest so that is it for today. I have so much more autumn stuff. Really good. I'm going to make sure you have the proper, proper capsule wardrobe for autumn. The, the uh, proper pieces. Small wardrobe. It doesn't need. You just need the, the best, proper, workable pieces in your wardrobe. Pieces that work together in unison, in harmony with each other. All the colours can be mixed and matched. So you can make 10 outfits out of four. You know, out of four items, five out, five items, six items. That's where we're going with the channel. Of course, we're going to do bags as well. We're always going to do bags. We're going to do travel. We're going to do a bit of everything. But I'm definitely going to do more styling and more clothes. And I hope you stick around for that. Thank you so much, guys. And it's great to be back. See you in the next video. Mwah!